So this is where we talk about the nuts and bolts. Obviously it costs money to do this. You get the vision and the heart behind it, but this is how we do it. And this is why we're remodeling the auditorium uh, in the warehouse. We wanna give you some hard numbers in just a minute, but really just to know that it is hard to sell this. And the reason why is most of the money goes to things that we like to say aren't sexy. Like no one really cares about HVAC. No one really cares about sound dampening until it blows your ears out. But most people don't understand the cost of these things. And even right now in the world, everything has gone up so much. I mean, you're feeling the pinch, I'm feeling the pinch, but everything has gone up so much that it is hard to sell these things because as Americans, we like to see it. We like to feel it. We like to touch it. And a lot of these things just aren't that. But we also want to be a place that's state of the art. We want to be a place that has good visual, good sound, because that obviously matters. As I like to say, no matter what neighborhood you drive through in the Missoula area, rich or poor, most places have a 50 inch flat screen, which means visual is very important. But this stuff just costs a lot, a lot of money. But it is a one time expense for a long term investment in Zootown Church. And so we'll have you hear some hard numbers now of what it's actually going to cost and what your money's going to go to for us to get in to this place. It takes a ton of technology to make a Sunday morning service happen. Uh, this room right here, probably most of you have not been in. It's the central hub. We call it Overwatch. Uh, most of the technology comes into this space and that makes Sunday happen both in the room and online. All of our, our sound, our lighting, our video all comes into this space. So as we get ready to move into a new location, it's going to take a fair amount of finances just to move it over into that space. It could be $32,000 plus just to run the cabling and get everything into that space. And that's not including any upgrades that we're looking to make happen for that as well. We're hoping to eventually host concerts and, and plays and different events into that space. And as a result of that, we're gonna need to upgrade some of the things that we have uh, in place already. So things like speakers, um, in order to bring concerts in, there's a certain level of speakers that need uh, to be in place to have, to meet writers for bands. And uh, so for us, we're looking at $65,000 just for the speakers. Now that can seem like a lot, but if you look at the Wilma, when they upgraded in there, they spent a million dollars just on their sound uh, reinforcement. So we're trying to do this as fiscally responsible as we can, but we have to meet certain thresholds in order for that to happen. We'd like to give you a quick tour of the new space and Ty is gonna give you a couple more numbers uh, in regards to what that looks like as well. Hey Zootown, we're excited to give you a glimpse into the new auditorium space that's currently under construction. We realize it looks like a mess right now, but it is uh, taking shape every day. The improvements are amazing. It's fun to watch. It's an exciting mess for sure. And it's gonna be, every time we come in here, we get that much more excited for what it's eventually gonna look like. Uh, just standing in this space and looking out what, what it's gonna look like from our perspective, and then going back over to the, um, to the seated area and seeing what it's gonna look like from everybody else's perspective. We're just, we get more and more excited every week when we come in here. So we're excited to show you the space in more detail. Come on, let's take a look. <laughs> 